welcome back to all things melody and today on my channel i will be doing where you can find fashion inspo these are really places that i find my fashion inspo like things that i do little tips tricks well, not tips tricks but like people that i've really seen wear it i usually go pinterest instagram pinterest is really like the picture google like it's just pictures so if you need an outfit usually i go on pinterest and depend on the occasion i'll go and i'll be like black girl fashion because usually if you type in like just fashion they'll show you a whole bunch of dull things but you're know, like black girl magic we jazz it all up so the outfits when you type in like black girl blah 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 is usually more popping than if you just type in the word so, like say you're going to a dinner party so you could be like dinner party outfit black girl or you want an outfit for a corset you don't know what to wear usually you don't have to put if it's that in depth you don't need to put like black girl because it depends but if you want an outfit corset you could be like yellow corset outfit black corset outfit whatever you want even shoes go on pinterest say you have the shattered blackboard once you don't know what to wear with it because it's like it's orange not a lot of people know what to wear with orange and you don't want to look basic put on a t-shirt with some blue jeans or some black jeans so you go and you type shattered blackboard ones outfits and they're gonna show you so much different options that's why i really love pinterest pinterest is like one of my first go-to's i don't know for some reason today i'm really like tired okay so next after pinterest instagram i'm just gonna give you a couple instagrammers who i personally if i need some inspo i will go on their page see like oh something that they want or what they're wearing today where they getting this stuff from what brands are they using because sometimes it's the brands do matter like not saying that you need the high class alexander wang gucci you don't need all of that but there's like lower brands that they wear that's like sometimes the same price expensive sometimes it's cheaper but it they like they wear really good they've gone on these pages really introduced me not just to just what they're wearing but different brands as well because the brands is what carry what the other people want So the first person that I'm going to be using is Nay Spendery. I hope I'm saying it right. I hope I'm not saying it wrong. Her page is very like, it gives me a casual vibe with a pop. The pop is usually like the accessory. She, she's really good at like jackets, bags, corsets. Her shoes, like the top and the bottom don't even really matter. Her jacket, everything, it just, the accessories just ties everything together. That's why I really like going on her page. Because, like, I can feel like I have on the most basic fit in the world. I go on her page, I see a little accessory, how to put something. I'm like, ooh, that jacket with this, that would look better. For, in my opinion, she this is, like, for minor events, like a friendly hangout. You go in and walk around with your friends, take some cute pictures. I would wear the outfits that she wears for that. I feel like she pays a lot of attention to detail. That's why, I, that's why her accessories can always, like, tie it in so well. I feel like she's really good with that. The next person is Karen Jinsu. I know a lot of people probably heard of Karen Jinsu. Um, I feel like her page is very, very, very casual. Like, she gives me a lot of Fashion Nova vibes most of the time. Like, she wears a lot of, like, um jump jumpsuits or those with body she wears a lot of body suits and like two pieces but sometimes she really pops out like she has this gucci outfit right here that to me it was fire and then she has a lot of different outfits that she does too so she does the casual but then she like girl i could pop out too like that's her like she's like i might be on the run casual today but tomorrow you never know what i might pull out so that's why i like watching her page because you never know if she might do something extra she also does a lot of like mixing colors it's like she does a lot of attention detail like you see with this jumpsuit with the gray cardigan and the sneakers like that was that was a lot of different like yellow not a lot of people would be brave enough to put that together i really like it and she's thick so she shows like how shaping in different outfits because i personally i like shapeful outfits and her body her hair is just always on point so i really just go on her face so karen jinsu so next is slay lynn she is very 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 drippy i don't know she gives me low-key brooklyn vibes i don't know exactly where she's from but she's very drippy her color scheme is amazing her accessories is amazing if you go on her page she has literally an outfit for every occasion to go to the supermarket to go to the store to go out with your girls to go to the club to go on a date to go to dinner family event anything she has an outfit for it she's really great 
she does a lot of custom drip though like some of her stuff i can see like somebody made it that's cool too i like that type of stuff sometimes you need like a little custom you don't want something that everybody else has worn she does a lot of oversized looks as well because i know a lot of people like oversized but she does tie it back to the girly like she could be wearing an oversized outfit and it'll still look girly she doesn't like give off that whole tomboy vibe with it which i personally like because i really don't do well with the tomboy vibe i don't know i can't get it i be trying sometimes but i never really look like a tomboy so i prefer the whole like little baggy clothes but still tie it back to girl like with a purse and stuff like that so i like her next is that soli she her outfits are like very they look basic but if you like really zoom in and pay attention to the detail she does different things like you see this outfit here i actually really like this i don't know why but the whole suit vibe with the 12s and the duffel, I really like it. And she also have others like basic looks. She gives me a very much Soho vibe. Like you see the baggy sweater, the baggy sweats, the sneakers. She gives me very much Soho. I would like it though because sometimes I like to do a little quick outfit like that. Like I might not wear this outside like how she is. I would wear something like that like to the store. But even when I'm going to the store, sometimes I do take pictures. So if you follow my page, you will see the pictures I be posting. But yeah, don't forget to follow that but i would wear that but not how she wears it outside okay next her name is no underscore feelings she gives me the same vibe as that so Lee. it's very casual soho baggy sometimes she does do a little like a little leggings or something so it's not like baggy but it does give me very much soho vibes she does have a couple looks on her page that's a couple that's a little girly but i really like it she always accessorizes like she always, she has this cute fanny bag that i feel like goes with everything and when she wears it, it really ties the whole outfit together. I really like that. So she always accessorized. She has cute jackets. She mixes the casual with the name brand. Like I seen, I think she had a Gucci hat or something. Um, if, if that's true, I'm going to put the picture. But I think she had a, like some sort of hat and she wore it with an outfit. And it was like low-key a basic outfit. But then the little accessories really tied it in. So she gives me that little basic Soho vibe. But then she always has her pop, own pop to it. And I really like that. Next. I don't know if I'm saying her name right either, but it's Meme Joneses. She, her page really gives me life. Her page is like you going on a girls' night, a date night. You going out with your friends. You about to get lit. You want some tight clothes, like. And then she be wearing like she be mixing different brands. Going on her page, I actually found out about this other brand. When I went on her page at Meme Joneses, I saw that she had a lot of different styles, and she got a lot of her clothes from this one site. I can't remember right now, but I was then gonna order some stuff from it. Cause it had it was really cute. her clothes are usually really tight it's a girly look bougie she has like nice accessories the bags the glasses her hair is always done and then she does like really good with the color scheme like she made like if you see in this picture she makes the pink she had like the different pinks on and then the glasses her hair is up like to me this is so far if you see in this picture the snake print i really like it i really like this and then this is very like you still going out with your friends. You just you and your friends are doing some hood rat stuff. So you put that on. I really like this. Her outfit, really, I mean her page, really gives me life. Next is Latoya Chunk Smith. I really like her page. She's from Brooklyn. She's actually a hairstylist. She does like really girly looks plus the regular, you know, Soho looks, tomboy, casual looks. I really like her girly looks more though. Like when she does her girly looks, she pops out. Like if you see in this picture, you see the bag, the accessory that's fire then her hair matches with everything like i really like this and then her shoe matches her hair like i don't know if it's me but i really like this and then this is another one if you look in this picture you see the bag with the teapot i really 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 like that bag and you see her shoes with the fur the heels with the fur feathers why am i saying fur with the feathers i really like that too and then this is like a regular soho look I know a lot of people like this. I don't know. I can't get into the whole look. I feel like it just doesn't fit me. Sometimes I try and it'll look okay. But I don't know. I'm going to try to get into it more though. Okay, so thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Matter of fact, you're going to do it right now. You got six seconds. Okay, cool. That was enough time to do it. You better have did it. Because I know if you did it. Okay, but. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to turn on your post notifications so you can see the next time I post. See you next time. Bye.